welcome to Street Views. My name is Simon Woods. Today we're asking you your point of view on Donald Trump and Kim Jong-un and the situation that's possibly going to lead to war. Kim Jong-un and Donald Trump, what is your take on it? What have you heard? What do the young people know about what's going on? Wants to like, um, like cause war with them. Why do you think that is? Because I'm over what he was saying in the news and stuff. Right, just called him a bad name and said that's it, I'm going yeah. to war? Yeah. Do you think there's any reason behind it? He just doesn't like anyone. Have you ever done anything about uh, the United States and Korea in their history of war together in school? No. And we're asking about Donald Trump and Kim Jong-un and the standoff. Do you think there's going to be a massive war? What do you think should happen? I, I think so, because the way he's handling things, he's, he's threatening people when he's... When he's when he's uh, on the telly, he, he, he's, very, he's abusive, I think, you know. Do you think that's very presidential, the way he comes out with all these tweets? I and I do, I do. Um, that's, not, that's not his job. If Kim Jong-un, North Korea, was to attack Guam, uh, like bombing them, uh, how do you think the United States should respond to that? Well, he's going to have to, I suppose, you know, the, maybe the Americans will... will probably won't accept that he won't uh, do something about it because obviously there's a lot there's American troops in Guam there's American citizens so he'll have to he'll have to step up basically as they call it Donald Trump used the words fire and fury like the world has never seen what do you think that means when he he's threatening the North Korean people with that message what do you think that means wants like use nuclear weapons and cause war with them right. do you think that's a good thing or a bad thing bad thing what about Godzilla? If we had Godzilla out of it, would that be a good thing? <laughs> Today we're talking about Donald Trump and Kim Jong-un. Have you guys been watching the news? Are you aware of what's going on? <laughs> yeah, I have. Can you explain to me what's going on? With Did you hear the terms fire and fury and immense oh, power and all that? I not about that, no. Have you seen Donald Trump at all on the news in the last day or two? Uh, no. <laughs> I haven't heard about anything. No. Do you know what's going on with Korea? Uh, missile, 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 so I think they're yeah, okay. planning to launch a missile. Uh, I don't know. I think, I think well, the two boys, Donald and Kim, have been having a bit of a standoff with each other. Okay, this is basically what's going on, and there's a war of words going on at the moment. Uh, Kim Jong un has threatened to bomb an island called Guam, which is very close to Japan, North Korea, South Korea, that area, and it's actually US territory. So if they bomb Guam with a small nuclear device, what do you think the Americans should do? Mm. I don't know. Uh, Donald Trump will probably uh, use nuclear missiles back, but I don't know if it'd be a good idea for Asian to happen. Have you got your own nuclear bunker at home? No. No, you don't no, have one. I don't. Do you know anyone who has one? No, I'm looking for no, one. Just I am yeah. Too. But I'd say Donald has his. <laughs> I'm sure he has a mountainside somewhere he can hide I'd say, in. <laughs> I'd say so, and all his cronies. <laughs> Have you been watching the news, what's going on? Yeah, I was in hostel, so that was the only channel. Oh, all right, OK. Are you worried about what's going on? Do you think it's going to affect us here in Ireland? Yeah, it could cause world war, like... Yeah. <laughs> and then you'd have no channels to watch, then? No. <laughs> what about Kim Jong-un, last question? Uh, do you think... But do you think he's, he, the poor guy is misunderstood? I don't know anything about him, because as I say, I don't watch the news. I'm not really into politics. I just know about Donald... Donald Duck. Out of the two of them, which is the better looking? Who? Donald or Kim? Um, Kim, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> if they use nuclear weapons, do you think the Americans should strike back at North Korea? What they sh should they do? Should they use nuclear weapons or go for a ground invasion or just try and sweet talk them out of it? Um, I say should, they should just launch back with missiles. Um, yeah. Warheads, nuclear warheads? Yeah. yeah. What kind of ripple effect do you think they would have on the rest of the world? Uh, How would that affect you? Uh, I don't know. Um, I, I don't know. I don't really. Uh, you haven't thought it through. Do you have a nuclear bunker where you live? Uh, no. no. Are you going to hide under a table if, if World War Three breaks out? I don't know where I'm going to hide. <laughs> okay, and yourself? Have you got a nuclear bunker? <laughs> no, no, not a chance. I don't think anybody does here. You don't know anyone who has one, no? No. <laughs> <laughs>